block with a mass of 15 kilograms slides down a 43 degree incline as shown above with an acceleration of 3 meters per second squared. What is the normal force N applied by the incline on the block? So the first thing we're going to do is to draw a free body diagram acting on this object. So we know that the weight of the object, mg, points straight down. We know that the normal force is perpendicular to our surface. And we're not told anything about a normal uh, frictional force here, so we don't have to include that. Now, the one thing we are told is the angle of the incline is told to be 43 degrees. If we now also look at the direction of mg with respect to fn, we would see that the angle between this axis here is also given to be 43 degrees with the properties of geometry. So knowing this, we can solve for the normal force off the basis of the y component of our mg if we choose our axes to be directed in this manner where our y points here and our x points along in this direction. So this is our y-axis and this is our x-axis. Now if we choose this set of axes we can then see that if we draw it normally we have the y here, the x here, our fn would be pointing straight up. We would then have mg acting in a direction like this, an angle of 43 degrees. Now, if we write Newton's second law for the y direction, net force of the y is equal to may, we know that the object is not accelerating off the plane, so we know that the ay is equal to zero. So from this, we can tell that the sum of the Fy is equal to zero. If we now do the sum of the forces in the y direction, we would have Fn minus, now we have to take this vertical part here, which if we apply Sokoto to this, we would see it would be mg times the cos of theta because this is the adjacent side. So the cos of theta is equal to the adjacent here, which we want to get this mgx, mgy, sorry, over our hypotenuse, which is mg, giving us this y component of our weight is equal to the weight times the cosine of theta. So knowing that, we prove that our normal force is equal to our weight times the cosine of theta. Now, all we have to do is plug in our values and solve for what the normal force is. So let's do that now. So we know that the normal force is equal to our mass. Our mass is given to be 15 kilograms. The angle of the incline is 43 degrees. And we know that the acceleration of gravity g is equal to a 9.8 meters per second squared. Now knowing this, we plug in our values, so m, 15 kilograms, g, 9.8 meters per second squared, times cosine of 43 degrees. If we now carry out the multiplication, we would get our answer being equal to 107.5 Newtons, which corresponds to answer choice D. 107.5 Newtons is the normal force of the block when it's on the inclined plane that makes an angle 43 degrees with respect to the horizontal.